point three seven five as a fraction. That is uh, how to convert point three seven five decimal number uh, to a fraction. So every fraction has two part, upper part and lower part. That is numerator and denominator. So to convert a decimal number to fraction. Uh, so what can I do? At first, uh, I have to drop this decimal point, right? And I have to uh, make this number as numerator of the fraction. So uh, after deducting, after dropping this decimal, we are getting 375. That is 375. Now we have to write the denominator. Denominator uh, is the place value of last digit last digit so after decimal the first uh, place is a uh, tenth place then hundredth place and then thousand plus so here five is the uh, digit of thousands plus so i have to write here thousands right so drop the decimal point and make this number uh, the numerator of the fraction right then the denominator of the fraction is the place value of the last digit last digit of the decimal here last digit of decimal is 5 and the place value of 5 is 100 right and at last we have to reduce the fr uh, fraction to its lowest term that is we have to reduce uh, this fraction right so let us uh, show uh, let us uh, show another method to convert this decimal number to fraction look what i will do here i will write the numerator after uh, dropping the decimal point 375 for decimal point always you have to write one then after decimal point for every digit you have to write uh, zero so for three will will write zero for seven will write zero and for five will write zero and this is the easiest method right now look we have to uh, reduce this fraction so i will express this number as a product of two number and also i will express this number as a product of two numbers so that i can cancel right so let us show so i can write this 1000 by 100 times 10 that is if i divide this 1000 by 10 then i will that i will get 100 as a quotient right so look 375 so here last digit is 5 so it is divisible by 5 so let us show what come here 375 right if i divide by 5 what will happen 5 goes into 37 7 times 7 times uh, 5 35 if you deduct then what will ha happen if you subtract then 2 5 5 goes into 5 5 times right then 25 5 times 5, 25 0 subtract so 75 times 5 so if you know that this is the quotient time divisor is the dividend 5 right i can write this 10 as a product of 5 and 2 right so 75 times 5 divided by 100 times 5 times 2 that is 10 now look i can cancel this five this five right after cancelling we are getting 75 divided by 100 times 2 look i can also uh, split this 75 as a product of two numbers so here the unit place is five so it is div divisible by five so i can write five goes into seven one times so one time five five subtract 2 this uh, 5 will come here 5 25 
5 goes into 5 5 times 25 right so 5 we can split this 75 as 15 times 5 and we can write this 100 as 100 10 times 10 equal to 100 right again i can split this this 10 as 5 times 2 right now this 5 this 5 cancel each other right so i am getting 15 10 times 2 times 2 right i can also split this 15 as 5 times 3 and i can split this 10 as 5 times 2 right so now look this 5 this 5 cancel each other we are getting 3 and here 2 times 2 times 2 so 3 over 8 there is no common factor between uh, these 3 and 8 without 1 so this is the lowest term and it is the answer thank you for being this video be well